Now, the agriculture industry is a vital one to Kenya's economy, employing about 40% of the working population. But the country is currently in the grip of a drought and the sector has been forced to adapt to the realities of, this, of, of climate change. For this report, our team in Kenya look at how digitization is helping farmers there and how it may even combat regional food insecurity. Perpetual Muni is not a farmer like the others. Phone in hand, she prepares the next harvest with the help of the AgriBot application. 0139, the AgriBot. Mm -hmm. So from there, you have an option what you want from the AgriBot. After two years without a rainy season, she had to find alternative crops that can withstand the drought with free information provided by the application. This time we have all the information, the best things to use, the spacing, eh? the preparation, everything. Yes, okay. it really has it. And from that you get high yield. The Alliance for Green Revolution in Africa and Microsoft created the app in 2019. Still in the pilot phase, it is already used by 50,000 smallholder farmers. To go further, Embu County is launching a new public-private partnership to ensure food security and practice more sustainable agriculture. Where possible, where you can get um, institutions, whether big or small, that are able to partner with development partners and government, that is what we promote as an institution because we know that now none of us can independently drive a transformation in agriculture. So partnership is really the way to go. A profound transformation also promoted by the United Nations while the Horn of Africa has suffered for several months the worst drought in 40 years. Digital agriculture is going to continue playing a, a key role in the region. And it's very clear that in time of drought, the more we get information on the forecast, accurate forecast, and the more we can make sure that the information is reaching farmers, then the better the farmers can adapt to the context. Ultimately, the AgriBot application is intended to be used by the entire African continent. According to World Bank projections, agriculture could represent a sector of nearly a trillion dollars by 2030.